My name is Gunther Schlierkamp. I got the special invitation for the Mr. Olympia. It's my second one today. I do my back workout and you can watch me. <laughs> okay, come on in. <laughs> Right now, I have two training partners. They kick my butt. One of the guys is uh, Frank Hillebrand. He's a professional bodybuilder also. And the other one is Chip, a friend of mine. He's very strong. And uh, when I get tired, they kick my ass. <laughs> Uh, I won the uh, world champion Mr. Universe in 93. I turned in 94 pro and I uh, was at the Mr. Olympia the first time in 94. Uh, I didn't had a call out at this time and uh, then uh, I thought maybe I have to move to, Amer uh, to California because uh, it is a mecca of bodybuilding. And uh, I moved last year with my wife from Germany to California. This time I compete uh, because of a special invite from Joe Weider and uh, it's a Mr. Olympia and we will see what happens this time and uh, I think I can, I, I'm doing really good and I can bring a complete package and uh, I improved a lot. I'm, I think I'm around 20, 25 pounds heavier than in, than in 90. Uh, for and I think actually that my symmetry, my shapeness, my muscle quality are much better and uh, we will see what happens. My goal is uh, to reach uh, for sure the top 10 and uh, I train as hard as I can. I love to train, I do it from my heart and uh, that's what I want to do and uh, bodybuilding is actually the greatest sport for me on earth. <laughs> yeah, now we are two weeks uh, uh, in front of the competition of the Mr. Olympia and uh, my what, what I want to do actually the next uh, two weeks is uh, I increase my cardiovascular work and uh, my metabolism is actually very fast and I never do um, my uh, like a carbohydrate de de depleting diet i actually i have the whole time uh, like not as much pro, pro i have protein but like well, i would say 40 uh, 40 50 percent protein is my meal uh, from the calories a day then i have like 30 grams of uh, carbohydrates uh, 30 percent of carbohydrates and 20 percent of uh, 15-20% of fat and uh, what I want to do actually is only increase my cardiovascular work. Uh, I take still a lot of sodium. I go only out with the sodium three days in front of a competition because uh, what I realized is the sodium is really good. You don't get cramped and you keep more water in your muscle also and uh, only to lose the last water what you still keep in your skin. You, I, have a, I think the most effect you have is three days in front of a competition. When you take your sodium out three days in front of a competition, then you have, uh, for me, it's the biggest effect. Then I, my muscle is still full and I can tell that my skin looks much, much thinner than I did it uh, today in the workout. And uh, I think I'm almost right there. I, right now my weight is like 292. I want to compete at 285, 288. That's my goal, and uh, then I'm probably eight pounds heavier than I was in the springtime.
I have to say, actually, I can kick my butt very good by myself. But still, you, sometimes when you have like, uh, you walk into the gym, you have, you have the diet and everything. Sometimes you are tired and it helps a little bit. But uh, I'm really motivated and uh, I, I can kick my butt very good by myself. But still, it helps sometimes, you know, for the last one or two reps that somebody helps you, sometimes it helps and when somebody says, or sometimes you don't feel when you get, you slow down sometimes to the end of the workout and when they say like, come on, come on, it's a Miss Olympia, then it gives you another motivation and you wake up and then, okay, you have to do that, you have to do the last reps, you know, it helps a little bit, yeah. But also I can train by myself. At first I had to get too used to it uh, again because I had a training partner in Germany years ago. Then I trained for like almost three, four years by myself. And uh, I did the dieting by myself. I did everything by myself. And that's how I learned a lot about nutrition and everything. And I find out the right way for me, you know. A lot of people, they can, you know, you have to find out what is for you the best. A lot of people, they work better when they t don't eat any kind of carbohydrates, more fat. A lot of, some people need carbohydrates, more protein, less protein, higher fat, less fat. It, you have to find out what is the best for you and what works for you.